What does the American dream mean to you? The American dream is me being able to have a large house with a big piece of land connected to it. It's about having a nice family and a dog with in, in a yard. It's about being able to provide for like all your kids, send them up to a good school, pay for college. It's you know, it's it's like hard work and uh, and just having you know, not really having like ultra nice things, but like nice things that are quality. It's um, it's knowing that you worked really hard to get there, having a good job. Um, just doing whatever you like. It's not, it's not all about having a ton of cash. It's about having the skill and know-how to get enough done so that you can do whatever you want to do with your family. That's what it really comes down to, the American dream. Giving, giving everything you can to your family and providing for them. And that's my dream for the American dream or whatever, you know. Um, I don't think providing for your family, giving them as much as you can, is really different from, you know, my pop's version of it. Because I think, I think he's living the American dream. You know, we have nice things, but none of it's really luxury items. You know, we can afford to go to school. We can afford to have a nice house with a yard. And we can afford to have leisure time and go play golf once in a while. Um, more or less, I don't want the same thing. I don't need fancy diamonds and really nice things. I just need stuff to get me through, a car to drive me to work, and good education to keep me going. Preferably to med school. It's mostly about providing the best you can with what you have and being happy while you do it. It's not... Money doesn't buy you happiness. It's if you're happy and you have money, it's great. If you're happy and you don't have money, yeah, that's great too. Just as long as you're happy what you're doing, that's the American dream to me. So Do you think that the American dreams changed since the economy's in a recession? <laughs> I think I do think the American dream has changed since the economy's in a re recession. People aren't really worrying about, you know, vacation time and having super luxury items, you know, the American dream of like a mansion, you know, 10 cars. That's not so much the American dream for the public anymore. It's more about being able to pay your bills on time and keeping your home. Um, I think the American dream is just being able to have a home right now and being able to live there with, you know, your loved ones. It's not about um, it's not so much about the materialistic as it used to be, I think, because the economy, people are more just happy to be able to have what they have. You know, even with all these jobs losses going on, um, people are thankful for what they have. Do you think that, um, or what do you think people are doing to still keep, like, their thought of like what they think the American dream even though the economy has gone down like what do you think people are doing to keep kind of like their hopes up that they can reach their American dream maybe taking more time in school taking it more seriously putting more faith in um, in the Americans ability to innovate and coming back even though we're going through a tough time it's not like we went through a tough time before we made it through then, we'll make it through now. We just know it's a tough time, we'll have to weather through it. You know, we have to take some sacrifices now, but in a couple of years, everyone will be on their high horse, everyone will be happy, jobs will be flowing, and money will be flowing, and people will have more than enough time to go to the beach and hang out with their kids. Okay, thank you.